Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Little pack break right here to uh, knock out Noir, which is sold out. It's gonna be coming up in a separate video after this. As always, we're gonna do the break itself first. So let's roll it, let's randomize it. Three and a two, five times for each list, and then different dice roll uh, for the giveaway. All right. We are just talking about the, uh, just off camera, we were talking about this year's draft class compared to possibly next year's draft class is going to be better, worse. I think the common thing to say is that it's going to be worse five times for the teams here. But my argument was like, well, didn't people say it was just going to be Zion and RJ and that was it? And I pointed out, I mean, did anyone see John Moran coming? But I guess John Samuelson was like, he was incredible in the tourney. And I was, Murray State, right? I, but I think that's where he first got his stock, though. I don't think anyone saw him coming before the tournament, did they, John? I don't remember John Moran saying before. The, I don't watch a lot of college sports, but Travis with the Grizzlies, Jeremy with the Pelicans. That's interesting. Maybe a little pack break could be a surprise here. This year's... This year's draft class will be better than this upcoming draft class, FSL saying. That seems to be the, the general consensus. But I hope that we are uh, we are proven wrong. It's been a while since I've seen a pretty just completely dead draft class. I want to say that every year... There's at least been one or two people that people want to I don't know. I feel like maybe that 13 14 draft class wasn't that hot until Giannis like blew up. Yeah, I that that it'll be interesting to see what the fallout is going to be from from the pandemic. FSL from COVID so with people that, not playing in the tournament and how that affects the sky and you're like walking around. You're oh like, yeah, the that? mummy was terrifying. When I first saw this, couldn't sleep for days. Yeah, the 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 yeah, the, you know, the face in the chubby, sand and the, the guy that gets uh, the beetle in his whole body. Oh, oh. <laughs> and you see it crawling under its skin and He's all like that blue stuff. Gold. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, okay, dude. Oh, that guy's dead. Brendan Fraser and uh, Rachel Weiss is in this too. She's pretty easy on the eyes. Rachel Weiss is married to nice John Morant, Daniel Cre or Ray Fines. Base John Morant, not bad, Travis. Should cover the spot. Pink camos. No, I think you're. I think you're right, FSL. Yeah, that. That's why. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see the fallout. So many people do watch like the tournament, and they'll be like, "Oh yeah, I'm collecting this guy because I saw, you know, Grant Williams, for example. I don't know what he did in the tournament, but it, like, he went off and blah 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 blah. So, Travis with the Celtics, that one too. So he gets those two. All right, now let's see who's going to win those final 10 spots in Noir basketball. That's the second half of the case we popped open a little bit earlier today. So everyone gets a shot at it. So let's copy everybody's names over. New dice roll. And two and a four, six times. Top 10 after six. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, and six. All right, so everyone here, thank you. I appreciate you giving it a shot. Everyone up here. Congrats, your winners, Oliver, Jay, Mike, Derek, Mike, Jeremy, Ryan, Jay, Kevin, and Kevin G. Kevin M, Kevin G. There you go. Congrats to the top 10 right there. You're in Noir, which is coming up in a separate video. Check it out. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you for that one. Bye-bye.